I know your type. You're a surgical junkie. Yes, sir. I'm just saying, it's not going to be easy for you to be away from the OR that long. No, sir. And if you want to get back to the OR, you're going to tell me what I need to know, aren't you? You're right. It's not easy for me to be away from the OR. It's not easy for me to sit in front of you or any other authority figure, for that matter, and not be able to give you the exact answer you want to hear. I'm the one with the answers. I've always been the one with the answers. But right now, sir, I don't have any. Dr. Yang. How do you keep your edge, sir? Because I watch you, and you've been doing this a long time, and, and you're clean. You're focused, you are the job, and nothing gets to you. And the thing is, sir, I was like that until I got here. Until I actually started doing this job, and now everything is... is fuzzy. That's beside the point. No, see, sir, this what? is the point, because I can't tell you what happened in that room. I can't tell you. And before, I could have. No guilt, no loyalties, no problem. Before, before I wouldn't have even been in that room, I wouldn't have gotten involved. I would have never frozen in surgery. And I would have told him what I thought he should do. I had an edge, sir. I had an edge, and I've lost it. And I need it. I need it back. So, if you could just tell me how you keep yours and how not to be affected. I know I could be a great surgeon. So if you could just give me the answers, I would really appreciate it. You're excused, Dr. Yang. But... You're excused. I'll tell you. I'll tell you who cut the Elvad wire, no, sir, you if you won't. could just please... I don't want to know. Not from you. I, mean, I have the answers, but I can't tell them to you. I'm not going to be responsible for you becoming less human. I'm a pretty girl. What? I'm not being arrogant. It's just... It's just kind of a fact. For a long time, I made a career for my look, so I get it. I'm a pretty girl. And not enough from a certain angle way, in an obvious way. It's the blonde thing and the big boobs thing. Big boobs are key to obvious pretty, if you know what I'm saying. Dr. Stevens. That's how men see me. I'm not a smart girl or an interesting girl. I'm a pretty girl. The blonde and the boobs, it confuses guys into thinking that I'm someone else. And I'm used to it. I'm used to them walking away when they realize. But then Denny goes and asks me to marry him. Is that why you cut the wires? He doesn't make me feel like I'm a pretty girl. He makes me feel like... Like me. I think he might know me. And so if I did cut the Elvad wire, and I'm not saying that I did, but if I did, then no. I don't feel guilty. And I know that I should, and I would if it were anybody else. But I can't feel anything but happy.